This video is about my experience with uh, personal development um, books that a lot of people have come across, especially by um, authors like Anthony Robbins, um, Deepak Chopra, um, Stuart Wilde. Now this part, this, these authors and many of the other authors are part of the personal development movement, which many of the authors are American, US based. Some are UK based, like uh, someone called Paul McKenna. Um, this whole collective is part of the personal development uh, movement, which has um, taken a lot of po money from our pockets. This is one of the biggest scams happening right now. Uh, I used to read a lot of books. I bought CDs. I bought books. I bought um, I bought many audio programs on these um, literature. I also came across a lot of it uh, for free. It's it's one of the biggest scams that is happening where you just don't know how it's happening because. It feels so good. This is how many of the motivators, many of the speakers, how they are so convincing. But what you're getting is nothing. You're just getting a charlatan speaking and selling you something. Whether it's uh, via just a book that you pick up or an audio program that you listen to or a seminar that you go to. Now, personally, I've never been to a seminar. I've bought books, I've uh, bought an audio program and um, when you think about it in, uh, in terms of many people, not just me, thousands or possibly millions who have spent money, it's absolutely rubbish what is being uh, sold and what you're spending your money on. I do have my reservations about certain authors like uh, Dr. Wayne Dyer, who has written some amazing books. Those books I've yet to make a certain judgment about because because I really feel that some of these um, talks are very good, by especially like uh, Dr. Wayne Dyer, but. The majority of the others are um, a complete scam. Salesman techniques, whether it's um, Zig Ziglar, um, Anthony Robbins, who's probably one of the biggest superstars in the personal development movement. These seminars, which they hold in auditoriums, some of them are held in the UK, mostly in America, it's just a mass, mass way of making money. It's getting everyone in one room, doing a blah 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 speech, possibly having products to sell. These seminars which are held uh, in outdoor retreats, this whole thing with the fire burning, it's just another gimmick. You know, to kind of like make you feel that, wow, something is happening here, you know. This means something, it means nothing. You, know, you could possibly burn your feet on the cold. Not that I'm saying you would, because you won't. But these are all part of the tools to, to be part of the package, to make it convincing. But it's not, you're wasting your money. There are many books out there. One of the other authors that I um, believe is selling a lot of rubbish is Anthony, sorry, um, uh, Paul McKenna, who's got this series of books. I can make you thin, I can make you rich, and so forth. It's, um, I, I personally have come across the books, I've read them, but I don't buy them anymore. I don't 
buy them anymore. They're sold in bookstores because they can sell. And someone's getting rich. Someone's getting rich from telling you that um, that this or that is the way, and you're paying some money when you could clearly have your old common sense. They pry on insecurities. It could be relationships, your body weight, money, stuff which just needs your own natural um, skills in life to be able to handle in life rather than someone else who will give you advice but is also charging money some ways. Whether it's a book or an audio program. A lot of people have got in there because they know they can make money and then live their own luxury lifestyle. A lot of salesmen have gone into this uh, industry. A lot of snakes, snake oils, you call them. Um, my personal development uh, story began, I must have been about 17 or 18, when I picked up an anti Anthony Robbins uh, book, which shows Unlimited Power. I read that, I was amazed, I used to talk to everyone about it. And um, then it began to, began to wear off, especially when you're writing goals down and it doesn't physically come into fruition. Um, you then kind of realize that writing these things down is just, just, just a fantasy. It is. It's just a fantasy. It's not real. It's not realistic goal. It's not whatever it is. It, the book hasn't been directly involved in the fruition of your own realistic goals in the real world. Um, I've read um, Unlimited Power, I've read uh, Awaken the Giant Within, I read another one which was Letters to My Friend, um, I've read many books by Dr. Wayne Dyer, See It, You'll Believe It If You See It, which I think is quite an amazing book. Um, it's if someone has a good sense of a scam if you're very good at spotting scams someone will be able to uh, stop themselves from being just drawn to it for us many people have and it seems a lot of American families have and um It's something which needs to be stopped, made more, there needs to be more awareness of it. I've read a wonderful book by um, Stephen, Stephen Salerno, who's written a book called uh, SHAM. Uh, the acronyms are for uh, the self, uh, self-help self actualization movement. SHAM it is self-help and self-help actualization movement and I've read this book, uh, I borrowed it from the library and he has exposed so much about the charlatans that are in this industry. I've yet to make a judgment about many of the other authors yet but what I'm saying is if there's a huge amount of money involved in some of these seminars if there's a price to pay, then you're going into something which is ridiculous, or crazy, and you're going to get scammed. If a seminar, the door entry entry fee is in UK money ten pounds, you're probably going to something which is probably reasonably priced. If something is charging uh, five hundred US dollars, then you're going into something which is Again, you know, you need to be aware why it is so expensive. There are many other forms of scams or many other forms of things being sold on the market. 
that are part of this unregulated industry.